All right, now it's time to look at the epic solo to Stairway to Heaven. All right, so this is a pretty straightforward solo, though. I mean, this is one of um, Jimmy Page, a lot of times in his solos, he would really just be kind of going for it. But this is a, a kind of a composed solo, so you can really get it down note for note really well and pretty easy. So we're going to start here with a whole step bend. It's a seventh fret on the third string. And we're going to do this little run. We're going to start at the, this is just a call, uh, the uh, pentatonic scale. We have, we'll start at the A on the, uh, the fifth fret on the first string, then pull off eight to five on the second, then seven to five on the third, then you come to the fourth string, pick that seven, then come back over, roll back over to the seven on the third string. So you just pick that seven on the fourth, come back to the third string, pull off seven to five again, then seven to five on the fourth, and then end with your pinky there at the um, fifth string, eighth fret. All together. Then we come up to here. So that's just fly from 8 to 10 on the second string, and then pick 8 twice on the first string. Then come up to the 13th fret on the second string, whole step bend, then pick it, release the bend and pick it again, and then pick 10 on the second string. Take your second finger and slide from 12 to 14 on the third string. Then play 13 on the second string. Then do a pull off from 15 to 13. And then a pull off from 14 to 12 on the third string. And then come over to the fourth string, 14th fret. And then pick the 12 again on the third string and hammer back on to the 14. So from here we got this. Alright, then we come back down to this fifth position pentatonic shape again and do a little bit longer pentatonic scale lick. This is what it's going to be here. Sorry. So after we come back down to the... So we're going to go... Kind of the same as the first one. We start at the 5, pull off 8 to 5 on the second. Pull off 7 to 5 on the th third. Pick that 7 on the 4 again. Come back to the third string once again, just, just like the first pentatonic run. Pull off 7 to 5. Then pull off 7 to 5 on the fourth string. But this time, come down and hit the seventh fret on the fifth string instead of the eighth and holding that. Pick the seventh, then come back up to the fourth string and pick. So this is basically the only thing that changes is from here is where it's different at the very end. So here you hit seven, then hammer back on five, seven. Brief hold on that note. And then come to the fifth fret on the third string. Hit that three times, and then once open. And then we have another pentatonic run. And this is uh, similar again, starting with the first, fifth fret on the first string. Pull off eight five on the second. Pull off seven five on the third. Come over and pick that seven on the fourth string. So we've seen that before. And then we come back to the third string this time and do a quick little hammer pull. At the five, from five to seven, and back down to five. That's on the third string there. 
and then come to the fourth string and go seven five seven five. You can pick both of those. So we got, the, we got this, and then we end it once again with the the eight at the fifth um, on the fifth string. So those two pentatonic licks together. All right, now we get to this next phrase. All right, so from here, we got slide to the seventh fret on the fourth string, five on the third, and six on the second string. Then pull off seven to five, and just play seven on the fourth string. And then come up to the seventh fret with your third finger uh, on the uh, third string and slide from seven to nine. So after you do this slide to nine, pick eight twice on the second string, then ten, and then eight on the first string. Then we have this little, and that's a whole step bend at the tenth fret, first string, then pick ten eight, then pull off ten to eight. Then hop up to the 15th fret. So that's a whole step bend at the 15th fret on the first string. And then pick 15 to 13. And then come to the second string and do. So that's again, bend, then release it, pick it again, 13, and then 14 on the third string. All right, and then we do one of these little uh, kind of repetitive figure here. It kind of starts first with these two notes, 14 to 13, um, on the, from the third to the second string. And then we do this figure over and over again. We do this figure 10 times. What that is is just basically whole step bend of the 15th fret, Release it, bring it back down, pull off to the 13, and pick 14 on the third string. And then we just repeat that 10 times. And then after 10 times, you, you're going to do a whole stat bend at the 15th fret on the first string. All right, and then we start this little phrase. That is just 12 on the first string, then down to 15 on the second, and do that again. So, so when we get down to this 15, that kind of starts us going to this 15, 13 on the second string, then we grab 14 on the third, Back to the 13, back to the 15, and then back down again. And then back up. So I kind of just went. Just did it, went up and down. I went down and up twice. So we have this. And then we have this little the whole step bend at this 15th fret. Whole step. Why you got that bent at a whole, um, all the way up? Pick your pinky at the 15th fret on the first string. Pick it, then pick the second string again. Bring while bringing that bend and bring that bend back down. Play 13 and then 14 on the third string. So we have this.
Then we do now the kind of like we go back and forth between doing the uh, whatever he's Robert Plant doing his thing, and he um, they're kind of uh, going back and forth, answer and you know call and response type effect. So they do that first vocal melody, and then this one comes his first fill here responses. So that's basically just a whole step in of the 19th fret. And then 20 on the second string. And then 17 on the uh, first. Back down to the 20. Pre bend. This the back, pre bend that 19 where you had bent it up before. Grab that and bring it down. Oh, I'm sorry. Bring it down, pull off to 17, and then pick seven, 19, 17 again. Come down to 19 on the fourth string, then 17 on the third, and back to the 19 whole step bend. So get from from the. All right. Then the next um, response, the vocal melody is this and so we have to take the 14th fret on the third string and you have to bend it a step and a half so it's a big bend you need to make it sound like that 17th fret there and then bend it again and then bend and then release that bend and pick the note flat. Then 12, 14. And then come down to 12 and do a whole step bend. Just to make it sound like that note of the 14th fret. Okay. And now our next uh, uh, kind of call and response thing is going to be. Um, starting at the tw 10th fret here, and we have to do a two whole step bend. So you're gonna make this note sound like that. It's a big bend at the at the 10th fret on the third string. So just and then and so after you get that bend holding it, then come back down and pick 10, 9, 7, then come down to 5, shift down to the 5th fret. Back to seven. And it's just kind of like he, as soon as he gets down here, he goes. Just slight bending on the seventh fret. Pull off the five and end on the seventh fret on the fourth string there. And then we had that very last little figure in it. All right, and all that is is take your first finger and bar it across the first and second string at the 17th fret, and then we're gonna pick we're gonna pick the 17 on the second string to start it, and then we're gonna go up and put your third finger at the 20th fret uh, on the first string, pick it, pull off, and then pick that 17 on the second string again. So you're pulling off the 17 on the first, then you're picking the 17 on the second. Don't worry if these two notes bleed together. It kind of he does that in the solo, isn't it? And you end it with a whole step bend at the 20th fret. Okay. And then now all we have is the outro section rhythms and the little outro solo. All right, we're almost through. Stay tuned. <laughs> 